decide what to do with King Egbert. I don't understand. What is there to discuss? We blood eagle him. Egbert is as guilty as Ella, so we should do the same thing to him. I've told you this too many times, brothers. I was here. I saw Egbert hand father over to King Ella. We all understand those feelings, Ifa. No one is denying what you are saying. But sometimes, sometimes, we have to consider things beyond our feelings and think what is best for our people. I know what our people want, Bjorn. And they want what I want. We have to consider our position of strength and use that to our ultimate advantage. <laughs> you always like to complicate things, Bjorn. You think it makes you look clever. And what if we kill Egbert Diver, huh? What then? Well, then he's dead, Uber. We are in the middle of an enemy kingdom. How long will it be before the Saxon forces gather up another army and drive us away? Exactly. So we blood the Egbert and then we move on. We raid this entire land so that they never have a chance to assemble another army again. Why would we even want to stay here? It is what our father wanted. He didn't just want to win battles. He wanted land here. He wanted to make settlements so our people could live and they could work. Mm, and we all know what happened. Yes. But in those days, he did not hold a king to ransom. Nor did he have a great army. We do. What about you, Sigurd? You've been very quiet so far. For sure you have an opinion. I agree with you, Ivor. Excuse me? We should blood eagle him. Finally, thank you. But I'm not sure. I'm not sure what they're saying. What I am saying is that we should do what our father always wanted. Yes. I'd like to speak. Well, I understand most of what you say, and I speak a little of your language now. I loved your father. He was my friend. And I know that more than anything, he wanted to build a farming community here. And you killed all this illness. Yes, it's true. I did. But now the tables have turned. We can make a new deal. What are you proposing? Well, as you say, it's only a matter of time before you're driven away from here. Without any legal right to English lands, you have no hope of staying. But I am king of kings, and I can give you that legal right. <clears throat> I will give you legal claim to the kingdom of East Anglia. It's a large kingdom. Because I am king, no one can question that claim. And it seems that you have enough men to enforce it until it holds. That's my offer. You should consider it. What do you want in return? I'll only tell you that once you agree to my proposal. <laughs> 